dump her in the... No, no, sweetheart, don't cry. Look, it, it, it's hard for me, too. Hey, how would you like a nice little son and daughter? Magic pair. Oh, they're real sweet kids. Well, you think about it. Let me know. All I want to do is make you happy, sweetheart. Keep you with me, close and safe, forever. Well... Nice. Lisa rarely snarls anymore. You notice? She's almost human. Stevie, deeply into his Swiss family Robinson chase. We were becoming a family. Rach, I don't want to be a stockbroker again. I know. On the other hand, I don't want to get killed by some maniac either. I know. Bannister. My banister. He said he'd never been in my house before. Home sweet home. Malcolm, I uh, fell faint. Well, I mean, I was uh, walking in, in the woods and, uh, uh, well, I knocked. And uh, what I needed was some water, so I just, forgive me, I, I should have waited outdoors. I, uh... My house is your house, Rachel. Did you find it? What? What you were looking for. The glass of water. Yes. Sure. Oh, 
I, uh, I drank right out of your tap, Malcolm. I was pretty shaky, so I just didn't bother with the glass. I, I should be going. Hi, John. Afternoon, Mrs. Yeoman. Uh, Rachel was feeling ill, so she dropped in for a glass of water. Are you feeling better now? Fine. Just fine now. You do look a bit pale, ma'am. Could I take you home? No, thanks, John, because I feel just fine. Take care. Thanks again. Bye. Bye. Get a hold of yourself. Malcolm Bryce is not a killer. He, he lied. He lied, that's all. Everybody, sometimes, would you shut up? Get home, will you? And stop talking to yourself. Your nice Miss Yeoman's looking for trouble. You like that Miss Yeoman, don't you? She's all right. She reminds you of somebody, doesn't she? The way she holds her head up to the wind. Who does she remind you of, Johnny? I don't know. The way she can smile and lie at the same time. I felt faint. Maybe she was telling the truth. She's just like your mother! Foolhardy. <laughs> they look like pretty little things. But inside, there's wickedness. Your mother was the same way. She pretended to like it here, but uh, we had our best moments at the house out on the lake. Oh, yes, she did. She refuses to leave now. Simply refuses. She's learned to love it down there by the lake. And she's changed her ways. She's a sweet, loving little wife now. And you couldn't ask for a better mother. Could you think of a better mama, Johnny? My fault. She won't chat with you. It's guilt, boy. She recalls that night. Dad? She recalls that night she tried to abandon you. You remember that night, Johnny? You remember when Martha made that little mistake? You watched her tiptoe out the door with moonlight in her hair. Pa! Pa! You cried. Come quick! Mama's running away! Didn't I stop her for you? Yes, sir. You were right there. I remember, sir. And and you helped me carry her back. Come on, take her feet, son. And you... How old were you, Johnny? Eight. Eight years old, sir. Eight years old. <laughs> and you helped me, didn't you, Johnny? Yes, sir. I know. Held those little red shoes tight to your chest. It was all for you, Johnny. I did it for you. I know that, sir. I know. Whose blood runs stronger in your veins, son? Mine, or oh, poor little Martha's. Yours. I belong to you, sir. How are you going to prove that, Johnny? Look at me, sir. Who's going to carry on for me after I pass away? I will. Keep the home fires burning. Uh huh? Oh. 
all by your lonesome. I can do it. No time like the present. Is there? Myself? All by your lonesome. Kill Rachel? Got to kill her. John, you... You think it, too. I have to do something for my father. I know. I know. It'll be all right. I have to. He said... Forgive me. Oh, my poor... You must forgive him. But it's not your fault. Listen, you are not to blame. Then you're not mad at me? Oh, you poor child. <laughs> Mama. My mama. It's okay. Mama. her. It's her fault. Well, she kept looking at you with woman's eyes, huh? Uh-huh. And holding on to me. Rocked you in her arms, did she? Yeah. She, uh, she tricked me. I think you liked it. No. Yep. You was easy on her. No. Then why don't I smell her blood on you? Why don't I smell it here? I don't know. What I smell is failure. Yeah. I raised myself a son who doesn't have the guts to kill himself. Nice. Lisa rarely snarls anymore. You notice? She's almost human. And Stevie, deeply into a Swiss family Robinson chase. We were becoming a family. Rachel. I don't want to be a stockbroker again. I know. 
On the other hand, I don't want to get killed by some maniac either. I know.